going on YouTube? It's Gaming Legend 23 here, back with another episode of Liberty City Big Dreams. This is episode 9. Last episode, episode 8, we bought our 16 Ford Mustang here, still looking great as you can see. And then we transitioned and got with the crew and got vengeance for little Jacob, Batman, and Ralph. Went ahead and take, took out the head of the snake, Freddy Paparo. So that is dealt with, he's done with, and we've got a revenge for good. Rest in peace to those guys. This episode, we're just going to kind of call it a night and then uh, ride through the city, see what we can get into. So let's get it. Just going with the flow, see what we can get into. Yep, let's do it. All right, we're rolling through Star Junction, Times Square, a.k.a. Wow, these textures are freaking buggy again this episode. I apologize. Everybody's out today. The game looks good. So uh, let's pull up and park it. Who is that right there? I recognize those clothes anywhere. Is that Luis from the Valley of Gatoni? Luis Fernando Lopez, is that you? I'll be damned, it's Luis. So me and Luis had a little chit chat. I'm gonna follow him. Don't know if he stole or if he owns this car, but uh, we're gonna follow him. He's got a job I need to do for him. He's gonna pay me. Uh, he said uh, he can get me into a fight club. And a bunch of stuff, and he maybe even friendship. So he's got a guy I need to deal with. We got to get a cop car. So let's do it. All right, guys, we're by the police department. We need to steal a cop car right now. Just sneak up here. Try to stay discreet. Scope it out. See what we got going on. Up here on the corner, maybe there's a cop car. Yes, there is, and there's cops over there as well. We're gonna need something to cover our freaking face. Let's put down the drop menu here. Um, I want the half mask. See, not the ski. Yeah, the half mask. All right. All right. Somehow we gotta sneak by him. I don't know what the hell this guy's looking at. People, bro. Bro, you better not fucking wrap me up, bro. Yeah, let's sneak over there. Let's go for it. Oh lord. Oh lord. Oh god, time to go. Do you have batches? Yep. We gotta get out of here. Gotta shake the cops once we lose the cops. We're gonna find an alleyway to park in or something and uh, use the police the police computer to search up Lyle Revis. Find out his location, where he lives. Alright, right here should be good. Let's pull it over. We lost the cops. Let's access the police computer. Search police records. Search by name. So Revis. Let's go ahead and type that in. Don't know who this guy is. We're just going to deal with him. And uh, let's hit search. See if we find him. Okay, we got Lyle and Tom. Obviously, we need Lyle. Yep, that's him. Let's mark him and uh, uh, go pick up Luis. What's up, Luis? I found him on the computer. Head to his location now. Let's do this. Okay, so apparently this is Law Revis' apartment. So let's head in. Alright, let's do this. Door's invisible. Huh. Law Revis, you've been taking money from Mr. Lopez. You're dead.
Alright guys, so that's that. We took Kyle of La Rivas. He is no longer a problem for Luis. We gained friendship with Luis and uh, this, uh, the hideout that La Rivas was using, that is now ours for a save point or a hideout in general. So we're going to go check that out and we'll probably call it a, the end of the episode here. Uh, so let's just park our car, head inside and check out the new hideout. All right, let's head inside. Cool little save point, nasty as hell, but this is our first hideout. So now we own an apartment and now our first hideout so we can get away from the feds or stuff like that. So that's gonna be the end of the episode, guys. I'm gonna call it one, the end of the episode and uh, you guys check in for the next. The story's gonna get even better, action packed. I've got tons of ideas. You guys have a great day, great night. See ya.